Hello guys, today I'll show you how Microsoft Office and Odoo SSO works. First of all, you need to start your Odoo server with database filter. This database filter is required because once Microsoft login redirects, it will hit the same database. After you start your server, login to Odoo. as an admin once you log in as an admin go to settings and activate developer mode go to users you will have two users currently in the system one is demo portal another two user go to OAuth provider to configure your microsoft authorization edit you will find client id and secret key so we need to enter client id and secret key here how you get this let me show you login to apps.dev.microsoft.com with your microsoft user and create your app so i have created one app you will get application id here and you need to generate a key let me show you how you can generate a new app go and click add on app give a name to that app create go to my application the app which I have created the name is test2 under test2 app you will find application ID copy it and save it here under client ID under your Odoo instance now you need to generate secret key here you can able to generate secret key by clicking on generate new password here is your secret key copy it and save it okay now your microsoft configuration inside Odoo is done let me show you what else we need to do here in microsoft you need to add a platform where the url redirects so right now my instance is running on localhost so i will give localhost and port number with this string i need to give permission to user read write so i can create a user inside Odoo that you will find it here user read write okay configuration is done save it go to your Odoo instance sign out from the admin and click here on login with microsoft here you will redirect to microsoft login with your application name test2 here you need to give the microsoft id which you are using or any of the microsoft id which you want to connect under SSO under the same domain give the id and password click on sign in it will ask for permission accept it now it will redirect to your Odoo instance as we have given the ID so here you can see your user is created so that's how you can connect any user under the same domain and you can give the permission to access Odoo modules here that's how it's connect thank you very much for looking at this video have a nice day.